What's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna basically tell you how to fix the crashing issue you're currently having with Battle.net. So stick to the end guys, this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you'll perfectly know what to do in order to fix this kind of issue. Before we start right into the video, I just want you guys to know or let you guys know that I would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, a comment or a subscription right into my YouTube channel. It would really make my day and help me out as a little YouTuber as I am. Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys, you would support my work here on YouTube a little bit and I'm gonna really really be thankful for that and I'm gonna thank you for that. So anyways, I would just say, let's get right started. So the first step is gonna be to navigate to the very bottom of your screen where you're gonna right click your taskbar and open up your task manager, just simply use the shortcut. Once you're there, I want you to navigate to the top left corner of your screen where you're gonna click on the processes just to ensure that you're sticking around it. Afterwards, I know it's gonna sound weird guys, but trust me, it will help you a lot. I want you to end every single task, which has obviously nothing to do with Windows. So let me explain that. Too many applications, too many programs, too many games, whatever, running at the same time on a PC or, or a bad PC will cause crashing. Um, and you're avoiding this issue by just ending every single task. The second reason is, like, there, like it was for me, there are some applications or background processes, don't ask me why, which are currently third parting your launcher, causing it to crash or to freeze in some way. So you're avoiding also this issue by just ending every single task and you're helping a lot of that. So once you're finished, I want you to end the task manager and simply take your battle.net launcher. You're going to right click it and go to the very bottom where it says properties. Once you're there, I want you to click into compatibility and simply copy my settings. So let's quickly run through it. Enable run this program in compatibility mode for it. Select Windows 8. Disable the disable full screen optimizations as well as enable run this program as an administrator. Hit apply and OK. I would personally recommend to reset your PC afterwards and once it is restored, you should be able to see this little administrator symbol right on your shortcut. This, um, yeah, you just need to start it afterwards and this will fix your issue. Yeah, guys, that's it for the video. I hope that I could actually help you out of this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. I'm going to really be thankful for that. Yeah, guys, I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but I'm just trying to do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.